rock dog and he plays the drums in his rock and roll band. Rock and roll band. He the world in his vocal box to beat the screaming fan. Story and day, or I just can't play. Once upon a time, yeah. can't stop. I'm hard at work. Will Mr. No. Bookaboo please come back to the stage? Bookaboo to the stage. No, I'm not going back on stage until I've had a story. <laughs> and today. I'm going to write that story myself. Right, just read that back. Niffle gugger bubba fuffles fifu woo woo. That's not very good, is it? That's not going to have anybody on the edge of their seat. Oh, I think this writing lark's a little bit harder than I thought. This is a whizzy chair, though. <laughs> woo! Ah! Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> I've let my fans down. <laughs> I've let the band down. Oh. Oh. I've fallen down. Go away. I'm not coming out. Hello, Bookaboo, you OK? I just came to see what's causing the delay. You know, we're really looking forward to the... Rock and roll, man. <laughs> it's a brilliant writer, Mr Michael Rosen. He's written loads of books. Oh, now I'm going to be letting him down. I'm sorry, Mr Rosen. Thing is, I was trying to write a story. What? You're swapping the drumsticks for the pen? Trouble is, Mr Michael Rosen, I'm finding it hard writing stories. Have you tried the whizzy chair thing? <laughs> Done that. Made me feel a bit uh, sick. I wouldn't recommend it. Ah, but have you tried getting up on stage and doing your concert? The roar and buzz of the crowd will inspire you. Well, the trouble is, Miss Mike Rosen, <laughs> I can't play unless I've had a story a day. Well, why didn't you say, Bookaboo? Look what I got here. <laughs> I've got the Bookaboo! He's got the Bookaboo! Come on in, Mr Mike Rosen! Oh. <laughs> Wow, wow, what a pad you've got, Bookaboo. Yeah, cool, eh? Hey, what's it like being like a top level drummer? Yeah, oh, well, it's, it's great. It's a bit like being a top level writer, I should okay. think. Hey, put it there. Oh, I hey. can't wait till my kids hear about this. This is fantastic. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, so, what's in the book about? Oh, right. Do you really want to see, do you? Oh, I really want to see what the book is. Okay, let's have a little look. <gasps> we got the book. I can see it. Yeah, here it comes. It's blue with a pirate on the front. It's called. The Night Pirates, and it's by Peter Harris, with oh. pictures by Deborah Allwright. De Deborah, they are more than all right. They are beautiful pictures. Oh. Shall I put my glasses on? Yeah, please do. Always helps, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, here we go. <laughs> down, 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 the dark, dark street they came, quiet as mice, stealthy as shadows. <laughs> Up, 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 the dark, dark house they climbed. Stealthy as shadows, quiet as mire. Who are they, Mike? Who are they? Only the moon was watching them when they arrived. Only the moon was watching them when they left. Only the moon and one little boy. What's his name? Tom was a nice little boy. Tom was a brave little boy. Tom was a little boy about to have an adventure. Who were these shadows, as quiet as mice, stealing away with the front of Tom's house? The front of Tom's house? Maybe monsters or trolls? 
Maybe ogres <laughs> or gremlins. <laughs> Maybe bandits <laughs> or pirates. <laughs> pirates. Pirates. Rough, tough, little girl pirates <laughs> with their own <laughs> pirate ship. Little girl pirates. A ship set for sailing. A ship <laughs> off on adventures. A ship. Stealing the front of Tom's house for disguise. For disguise? But what about Tom? Could he join the crew? Please, let me aboard. Can I come too? Well, what did they say? What did they say? And did the girl captain say, Certainly not. You're only a boy. Oh, no. Not at all. Instead, she roared, Welcome aboard! Ahoy! Welcome aboard! Then up went the sails and up went the flag. Then off sailed the rough, <laughs> tough little girl pirates, the little girl pirates and their shipmate Tom. Oh, we're off on an adventure. But where were they going? Yeah. Where? To an island where Captain Patch and his really rough, tough, grown-up pirates were snoozing around their full treasure chest. Grown-up pirates? Oh, no. Bit scary, Mike. Then Captain Patch saw something. What did he see? What did he see, Mike? Something very strange. What? Something very strange indeed. What? A house sailing towards them, getting closer and closer. A house sailing towards them with a little boy waving... Hello! I've seen a house! <coughs> Captain Patch declared. We've all seen houses, said the pirate. Who cares? Don't just lie there! Do something! Do something! Captain Patch roared. But the pirates went back to sleep and just... Snore. I think they'll regret that. While the house sailed nearer and nearer until... Until? Out leapt the girl pirates. Girl pirates. And out leapt Tom. Tom. And out leapt a fearsome... <laughs> Roar! The pirates gaped. Gaped? The pirates goggled. Goggled? And the pirates all ran away. <laughs> ran away? So Tom... And the girl pirates sailed away with the treasure while the rough, tough, grown-up pirates hid in the trees. Scaredy oh. cat, scaredy cat, scaredy cat. <laughs> Captain Patch stamped his feet and shouted his worst pirate curse. What was that, Mike? If you don't give me my treasure back, I'll tell my mum. You what? If you don't give me my treasure back, I'll tell my mum. <laughs> Big grown-up pirate. That's the scariest thing you can think of to say. But off they had sailed all the way home. <laughs> down, down, down the dark, dark street they came. Quiet as mice, stealthy as shadows. Up, 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 <coughs> the dark, dark house they climbed. Stealthy as shadows, quiet as mice. Only the moon was watching them when they arrived. Only the moon was watching them when they left. Only the moon and one little boy called Tom. Tom was a brave little boy. Tom was a sleepy little boy. Tom was a boy who had had an adventure. And no one would ever find out. Really? Or would they? <laughs> the house is upside down, look. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And the postman, he can't deliver the letters, can he? <laughs> Where's the milkman going to put the milk? I don't know. <laughs> well, thanks for reading me that story, Mike. Ooh! I loved it, Booker oh. Boo, and, and thanks oh. for letting me read it to you, man. No problem. No, I've got to get out there. I've got my bojo back! Oh. Yes! Where's my drum kit? Oh! <laughs>
Jenner booked today. 